won a very nervy semi-final midnight finish by a couple of frames. There's a lot at stake on that shot. And he's left a red. He, the, the queuing on this red is not, not simple. You can see, he didn't have much to do with it. Oh. Kind of already taking the same shape that it did the first four frames, isn't it, with Hawkins getting in front. Goodness me, you're not going to be in front for long missing those. I Hawkins won. That was not a difficult shot at all. Well, let's see how significant that is. It's up to Trump, who's, of course, scored more heavily than anyone this season, to make it count. Six. Seven. <laughs> well, that was not much fun. I think he slid a bit on the carpet. You can do yourself a mischief doing that. I always think for someone who's a left-hander who plays right-handed, these look very strange, these shots. Because if you're playing it that way, as a right-hander, you wouldn't need the rest. Anyway, got over Fifth. it. Twenty. Twenty-one. Just looking, is the pink spot free? I think it is at the top end, isn't it? Pretty comfortably, isn't it? Pretty comfortably so. It hasn't got to go down below the bunch. Twenty-seven. He needs high-value colours in play, and he's just about to get the black freed in pulling this red. Twenty-eight. Uh, it's a pretty loose bunch, really, with the pink above it. And if he was to play into these, there's no guarantees of, of working out as he would like. Still playing it. It may be on the left hand red through the gap. Yeah. 33. I think there you see the one that allows the break to continue. Six. 
34. Well, I think when he hit that, he thought he'd gone too far for the black, but he's okay. Yeah, he started to do that sort of slow walk <laughs> that suggests he wasn't on it, and then he suddenly quickened up. As I say, looking to want? rub in the fact that Hawkins let him in with such a glaring miss. 42. And I'm sure memories are fresh of that defeat Harry Hawkins suffered in the German Masters semis, because at 5 1, he looked an absolute certainty to win. Trump just found inspiration. I don't know if he got a kick there to keep Barry's hopes alive, but 49. when he potted that black, he put his hands to his head straight away. He looked pretty mortified. Plenty of room for manoeuvre there to finish straighter on the, the red. Something must have gone wrong. Good from 14. Wow, it didn't drop. Yeah, there was a, I did, detected a bit more arm waving from, from Judd there. He, I've seen him look happier out in the middle. One. disappointed Eight. with this I don't know whether I don't know what he thought whether he thought it rolled off or anything but I think he believes it was something that was out of his control whether he's right or not I don't know the only thing that can make things worse is if Hawkins goes on and wins the frame from it Seventy. Big moment in the match, I think. 20. This is only frame six of nineteen, but Trump we've seen visibly just not happy with the way things are going. Hawkins must have picked up on that as well. 24. Seen Trump steamroller so many players, haven't we? Won the Gibraltar Open, losing just three frames in the tournament. That's what he can do to people. He's not doing it yet to Barry Hawkins. Third. I mean, he, he actually left himself that red. He didn't get the best angle on the pink, but he was more than happy to finish high on the red. So I assumed he would feel there was no problem with it. So quite a few errors being made in this frame.
Oh. An awful lot of effort went into that shot. Four. <laughs> Unfortunately, he's finished it on the red, literally. Worrying table, actually, with, OK, a lead of 22 points, which wouldn't count for a great deal where the balls are. All the colours on their spots. So, yeah. a mistake. 22 points really wouldn't mean a lot if you held a lead of that kind. To jump for. Two reds, both near cushions, but Judd needs a pair of them anyway. Can't win the frame with the red and the colour. It's not a huge advantage he's got. Oh. Harry Hawkins. Uh, he didn't want to play the other red, the one that he could get to. He wanted to leave it on the cushion. The only good news there is the red, of course, didn't leave. get left near the middle pocket from hand. Judd can get through the left-hand red, but he has to be very careful now. Can't leave a pot on here. If he may even think about going for this red to the left corner. Did so in playing safe. I mean, they all count, Dave, don't they, these frames? Not, not a frame that would ever make it and chalk one up, haven't you, from sometimes, even like this. Yeah, and I think at the moment, this match is a bit of a mental test for Trump. He's digging in well here, but, but were he to lose this frame, having been in front, then that's even, an even bigger test going into the next one, with two left to play this afternoon. Port Knuckle looking very anxiously at this. Well, this is the chance he wanted. Just looking at the red by the green, which... It's also part of what Judd needs. 
You know, it isn't absolutely simple to get on. Should be all right, but he's still got to do it. If he's straight on the yellow, he can't get near the red. He could maybe pot it into the, the green pocket thin from below the yellow spot, somewhere down where he's looking now. That's probably all he can do. A lot of kicks, I think, out there, I have to say. It's, I we used, to, used to speak a lot about kicks, not as much in recent years, but they are definitely throwing off thick a lot of these shots. Yeah, Trump doesn't use that finished chalk, does he, that he said to eradicate them virtually. One. So, Barry Hawkins then, with now a very good chance to steal this frame and really pile the pressure on the world number one. Well, if he wasn't feeling all that before that last shot, Four. he won't be feeling any good after it because he leapt up in the air again, felt he had a bad contact. This time it might Six. cost him the frame. Yeah, and I go back to what I said earlier. He wasn't happy with this venue, was he? In the last tournament, the Welsh Open, he didn't like the conditions here then. Lost in the third round there to Hussain Bafai. Nine. Well, anything but that, anything but there, goodness. He can't get anywhere near the pink now. It was just a question of finishing top side of the blue. Not a difficult shot, blue to pink. He's going to have to play safe, I think. There's no way around it, not from the, the next shot, not this one, obviously. 18. So Trump will come back to the table. Just becoming a bigger frame with every shot that's played, isn't it? Twists and turns we've seen. Bye, Hawkins. 18. Well, he's played it well. He would like the, the pink to have bounced a bit further away from the bolt cushion. It's quite a big target now, but it's still advantage Hawkins. I don't know if there's any room to go around the back of it. It seems a bit unlikely. Well, he'd be more than happy with that. He wouldn't want that one back. It's funny, it's often the sort of lowest quality frames that ultimately, psychologically, make the biggest difference. Both will feel they could have won this, should have won this. Both will feel they could have lost it by now. Hawkins had a golden chance, though, after Trump got that kick on the last red. He needs both balls, Trump needs the pink.
I played the cushion in the cushion shot particularly well, actually. I never used to be, like to be on the wrong end of these shots. I don't really... There's not a great deal you can do here with these. Obviously, you get the, the pink safe, but you, you can't get any distance between cue ball and object ball. There's not, no way you can do that, which means usually you're in more trouble the next shot. Thin edge, I think. It's one of those where I mean, he couldn't have played it a lot better, actually. That's a terrific shot. It's one of those where if he'd have missed it altogether, he could have still won. If there's more than seven points in it. You might want to play it that thin in case you do miss it altogether. Or was it one free shot at it? And he played it particularly well. Yes, I don't think he went for that at all. I think that's exactly how he meant it, executed it well. It's going to be somebody very disappointed to lose his frame up there. These two, they should have both had it wrapped up at some stage. Oh dear. That's a, I can't believe he played it quite like that, pushing the pink near the pocket. There's enough angle on it to keep was heading towards the black anyway. If he pots it, it has to go somewhere down there. Six. Oh, what a frame it's been. Hawkins needs the black. Trump's played a lot of frames this season. I suggest this has been, for him, one of the least enjoyable all round. Big moment this. Hawkins with the black to leave 4-2. He falls over the line in this sixth frame. You can see just relief, really. Trump 